Hey guys, I wanted to show you one of my favorite summer crops. Um, this is Callaloo. They're young plants here. They get pretty tall. Um, I live in South Florida, so growing food crops in the summer is pretty challenging. I, I typically do okra, eggplant, um, yard long beans, and Callaloo. And um, these are the callaloo seeds. The, the stems get really thick. Um, and then you get this nice foliage. And you kind of have to prune them like, um, like you would basil to keep them from bolting. And also to encourage them to branch out and get bushy. But um, the leaves get big and they're really great in hot weather so even down here with 100, 100 degree days with humidity um, they do really well and uh, it's one of my favorite vegetables it's delicious it's if you could imagine like spinach and you can saute it it shrinks down just like spinach um, but it is Probably my favorite um, summer vegetable. And towards the end of the season, um, you basically just let a couple of them flower and they get these enormous seed pods um, that you can use to save the seeds. Um, but it really is. A delicious um, vegetable that you can grow in the hot weather. It's one of my favorites. You can see the stems get really thick and these are young plants um, so they get even thicker and typically what I do is I start the seeds indoors. I know you can propagate these by cutting as well but I start you know maybe six to eight seeds in a pot indoors and then I let them get you know, maybe about that big, and then I transfer them outdoors, and um, it's pretty amazing how quickly they grow. I mean, this this plant grows several inches every day, and um, you can kind of see where it's been cut once up here, and then it it sends out these other shoots um, to where you get a nicer, denser plant, and then. For harvest, what you do is you just take the tips like this and, and the leaves and um, just use them like a green. My favorite way is to just um, put them in a pan with uh, diced up ginger, garlic, shallot, and just wilt it um, with a little olive oil. And it's it, it kind of has the texture of spinach, but... Um, I think an even better taste. Really super good. Can't say enough good things about it. I grow it every year. I do a few patches of this stuff. So that's the Kowloo. Give it a shot for your summer weather garden.